Hey, check these out. These are rather large. These are uh, gallium crystals. Uh, <laughs> I had a theory that uh, under an incredibly strong magnetic field, uh, that liquid gallium would uh, crystallize um, very uniquely, and I was right. I grew some huge uh, crystals last night, even bigger than these. I'm giving these away to a buddy I'm actually meeting here. Um, but I forgot my tweezers were metal, so I had like three ounces of liquid gallium, which is basically the same price as silver, so not exactly cheap stuff. My uh, tweezers uh, fell into the container of gallium, and I was doing this on top of my freezer. Uh, <laughs> and the gallium spilled out over top of my freezer. I was like, oh crap, so I got three ounces of uh, liquid gallium on my freezer. And I thought, I'm going to get something to scrape it up with. But literally, as I was staring at it, it took less than like 12 seconds for this to happen. It went from liquid gallium to like little, uh, like large uh, rock crystal salt sized grains, you know, about four or five millimeter. 12 seconds that went from liquid to huge honking crystals. <laughs> so neat because the top of the freezer is cold the uh, melting point for gallium is uh, 88 degrees so it uh, melts at 88 and you know it refreezes or solidifies at 88 so <laughs> so cool <laughs> I'm gonna have to spill some more gallium on top of my freezer because the metal is uh, the top of the freezer is metal so it inst instantly transferred uh, heat dissipation to the gallium and it's amazing. I've never seen anything. It's just super rapid crystal growth and large crystal growth. <laughs> These are some of the crystals <laughs> that grew in about 12 seconds. <laughs> That's so neat. You got to be a nerd to appreciate that. Thanks.